everyone, it's Michelle from the Manhattan Elwood Public Library with another SIP Science experiment, Shelter in Place Science, that you can do from home with things you have at home. Today we're going to make an underwater volcano. To do that, we need one larger clear container, a smaller one to fit inside. I just used a salt shaker. It'll fit inside and it's already weighted down. I'm going to use some red and some yellow food coloring. And safety first, even though it's water, we don't want anything to splash in our eyes. You can use my glasses, and if you don't have glasses or safety goggles, you can always use your sunglasses. All right, so let's get started. I have put my large container, I filled two thirds of the way up with water, and I'm going to put hot water inside my salt shaker. So let me get my hot water. I'm gonna put it in there. You might need to get a grown-up to help you with the hot water. I'm going to put a drop of red so we can see what's happening and a little bit of yellow because when you mix yellow and red what together, what do you get? That's right, if you said orange, you're exactly right. So we're going to mix those together to make our orange lava so when our volcano explodes we can actually see it come up. Finish pouring the hot water into our container. Now I'm going to move over and push this forward so you can see what's going on. Now I'm going to drop that inside there so you can see our volcano as it starts to erupt. Now what's happening is the cold air is pushing the hot air or the cold water is pushing the hot water out and then you can see it come up underneath the water and it looks like a volcano. The fun thing about this is you can do this as many times as you want and use as many different colors as you'd like too. And there you have it, underwater volcano. See you next time. 